Sandeep Rana is now joining us. Thank you for your time. We are picking up from our sources within the ED that Sanjay Rao continues to not cooperate during the investigations. First of all, how do you react to that? He has been saying that when he communicated already that he will be available post the 7th of August, then what is this drama about? See, I'll tell you one thing. He will create all these things. He will do all nonsense things. He has bought in all Uddhav Thakre's gundes on road. He will do all nonsense things because he is not clean on his part, madam. If he, if he would have cleaned, then he would have uh, attended all the inquiries uh, as given notice given by the ED department. Now all the ED department has reached to his house and they all are searching about this. If it is clean, he should answer them. Why is not cooperating him? Why is not cooperating him? You know, MPs have been saying, Shifts and MPs have been saying that he is also a member of parliament. So what is wrong with him wanting to perform his duty as a parliamentarian and attend the proceedings in the house? See, that is what when they have worked against, they have misused their power against me. As a member of parliament, they have put me behind the bar only in the name of Hanuman Chalisa. I was supposed to chant Hanuman Chalisa in front of Uddhav Thakreji. They have done a same misuse uh, of the power and same thing. It is not used. They are not use, misusing the power against him. They are using their power. What power the law has given to the ED department. All the member of parliament from Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha, both houses, member has taken initiative and given all the powers to the department. He should go and face the department's uh, investigation. Why he is not doing so? Because he is a corruption. He has done corruption. He is a corrupted leader. See, tell me one thing. A simple editor of some newspaper, how, from where he gets so much of property that he has no answer to answer this department. If he is so clean, then he should go in front of them and answer everything. Where Alibaba's property comes from, where this go, uh, Goregaon's uh, Pat Patrachal, this uh, issue comes from. And 25 to 30 companies still are there where he is involved directly and indirectly with all the big shot uh, builders from Maharashtra. Where their all inquiry comes from. See, from Mahavikansa Gadi, he became an agent of Mahavikansa Sagadi and he was working and he is doing corruption for the, these people. See, Navneet these Rana, are you there. saying, my question to you is, are you saying that in spite of the parliament being in session, Sanjay Rao should have not attended parliament and should have continued answering the questions that the ED has been asking him both on the 20th and the 27th of July when the parliament was in session? Madam, that is what I am saying when he was there in Delhi. Main chief officer office is only in uh, Delhi. He would have removed two, three hours for the inquiry. Why is not given inquiries time for them? See, parliamentarian is made to make a law and he, they have to work according to law and constitutes in Savidan. Why he is not working according to that, madam? Why is being behind the parliament session is running? Because of that, I cannot give time. You are there for justice, to give justice and Maharashtra people are waiting for that justice. Ki all Maharashtrian people who work day and night, whose hard money is there and he's done corruption, taking their money. So he has oh, to answer, so, he's a corruption person. Okay. In, uh, Mara, yes. okay, you know, the opposition says, and uh, when I say opposition, I mean, uh, this has got to do with other leaders also in West Bengal, for example, in Delhi also, that how is that? That in so many months, in so many years, not one leader of the BJP has been questioned by the enforcement directorate. Is there no scam happening as far I, as BJP leaders are concerned? All BJP leaders see, are clean? I, See, everybody, if they are involved with the corruption, they should be get inquiry. Inquiry should be there against them. I am just saying that if some money of India is getting used like this, misusing the money like this, doing corruption, they should be charged, they should be behind the bar. And if you talk about West Bengal matter, two, three days before, when mm. they have put an inquiry against some a normal person like lady, from there, in that house, they have found 21 crore rupees, madam, and 1,000 crore rupees. 1,000 crore rupees, they have got the inquiry key. This is misused of West Bengal people. So people should be happy for this. Ki at least this department, department is working, who is doing corruption. Against them, this department is working so good. And I am neutral. I am not neither with this party, nor I am not this with this party. But I am just saying that if somebody is using... Money of India in misusing that money, they should be punished, they should be behind the bar, whether they belong to any party. 
as far as the possible law and order situation is concerned, there are Sanjay Rod supporters right outside his house. Many of them have been camping there, shouting slogans. There are concerns that there could be a disturbance as far as the law and order situation is concerned. Madam, I can tell you only one thing. They, have all, they are not the karekartas or they are not a party workers. They all are a bundas. Who, what Sanjay Raut has called. Because when my situation was going in Maharashtra because of Hanuman Chalisa, they came to my house, they have thrown bottles, they have thrown stones to my house where my small kids were there. So this is all pre-planned, madam. If somebody comes in between Savidhan, they should also get punished because they are protesting against a department who are working in the favor of India's money and in favor of India's people. So they should also get punished because of this. The opposition's common refrain has been that the ED is now constantly being used as a political tool to settle scores with parties the BJP does not agree with. What do you have to say about that? I can just tell you that he whether they belong to any party, that doesn't matter, madam. Hmm. Political leaders are never bigger than the Savidhan. Savidhan, the law, is bigger than any person, whether they belong to any party, whether they are a very big shot, or they are a very big businessman, or whether they are a very big political leader. The law, justice, and Savidhan comes before that, and they are the biggest one. Whether it is anybody who is doing corruption, they should be charged, they should be behind the bar, I can just tell you that. Thank you so much for joining us.